What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee discussion video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the alone form Pokemon and how exactly you're going to be able to get them inside of your game. Now, we do know that from the last trailer that you are going to be able to bring alone variants from Pokemon Go inside of your Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee games. And that's actually what this video is not about. This video, we're going to be talking about other ways to get get alone forms inside of the let's go games because the pokemon website has been updated with information from that trailer and they do cover alone forms and they actually go past what the trailer explained about how all the alone forms are going to be available to get in the game so in this section of alone forms inside of the pokemon let's go pikachu and let's go eevee website i'm going to have it linked in the description below if you want to check it out it says alone form pokemon certain pokemon have regional variants that is they have been adapted to the unique environment of one Pacific region and look and behave differently from the same species found in other regions. The regional variants of the Alolan regions are known as Alolan form. If you caught Alolan Pokemon in their Alolan form in Pokemon Go, you'll be able to bring them over to your Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu or Pokemon Let's Go Eevee games in the same form. But if you haven't caught any, don't worry. There are visitors from the Alolan region in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and in Pokemon Pokemon Let's Go Eevee who will be happy to trade you their loan form Pokemon with you. So this is huge for anyone who doesn't play Pokemon Go who immediately thought, wow, the loan Pokemon are going to be exclusive to Pokemon Go players. That's not the case. You're going to be able to get yourself a loan Pokemon throughout the world from trades from people who have visit the loan region. My guess is that we're going to see a split. We're going to see some alone Pokemon be able to get traded inside of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. The rest get traded via Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, which again, that would make the most sense and the best way to kind of spread it out. To be honest, nine times out of 10, I think we're going to see a ton more trades inside of these Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee games more so than we did in, you know, Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, which will make sense to kind of make up for the fact that we got a lot of Alolan Pokemon to give out. Again, I do think they're going to split it up, but let me know what you think. Which Pokemon would you prefer in which version let me know do you think this is a cool way to distribute a low end pokemon it kind of makes sense lore wise if you know somebody is gifting you the pokemon or somebody is trading you a pokemon for a pokemon that's in the game and stuff like that i think that would make sense but let me know how you think about it in the comment section below like always guys this is a open discussion i answer all comments so let's have this discussion in the comment section below like always guys i'm daddy and my friend on instagram and twitter and you guys could bring the conversation there i'm the american gamer in switzerland right here on youtube and yes i'm gonna be doing a ton of videos just like this one so if you enjoy please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video peace i'm gonna see you guys on the next one